All right, guys, Strongman's 5x5, day 36, workout B. There's some good and bad to this video, so I'll go ahead and start with the good. I got two pairs of 45s off of Facebook Marketplace from an old gym owner uh, for, for 80 bucks. It was a steal. I picked it up over the weekend. It was out of town, but it was worth the drive to get um, two pairs of 45s for 80 bucks. I, you'll, you'll never, you can't beat that. I'm sorry. I don't care where you look. Uh, if you know about buying weights and, and looking for plates and stuff like that, you'll never find a better deal than that. So uh, that was something I was very happy about. And I, and I went ahead and threw them on for these for this uh, 225 um, squat session here in the workout. So they're they're perfect. They remind me of the old plates I used to use during football and weightlifting. So I love them. Um, all right. So that's, that's a good in this video. The bad, it's... That damn overhead press, man. I don't know what it is. I'm, I, I think I hit a plateau. I'm stuck on it. Um, I think part of it has to do with with the range I have. My my right shoulder kind of got it twisted up a few years back, and I never got anything done to it or had any uh, physical therapy for it. So I have a lot less mobility in my right shoulder than I do in my left shoulder, and I'm not sure if that's what's causing me um, to not complete the workouts with more weight now or what it is, but I think it has to do with my form and my mobility. Those, so those are two things we need to work on. And I, it's funny, I don't really spend the extra time outside of weightlifting Monday, Wednesday, and, and uh, Friday for the program to, excuse me, for the program to, um, to spend on working on those things. And that's something I need to implement because I've just been busy outside of that studying for a test. I haven't coming up for a license and, um, things like that. So I, I got a lot of outside factors that come into play with this. I don't spend too much time focusing on weightlifting, but uh, when it's time to lift, it's time to lift. So I get into it. Um, other than that, everything was normal. The The deadlift was cool. Everything was good. Um, probably check out some different camera angles in the next upcoming videos just to see how things look and see if I can switch it up every now and then instead of the same old, same old. Again, me filming this is is more for me to work on my form and uh, to accept criticism and apply it to what I'm doing so I can be a better lifter and also um, do everything properly at the same time. You know, also I want to share my journey. There's no really end goal in sight. I'm just running with this until the wheels fall off. So we'll see. Um, I'm sure a few months down the road, I'll probably change to a different program. Um, and, and try to put on some more uh, strength as well. But I knew this was going to be the best thing for me to get back into weightlifting, so I just went ahead and did it. It's simple. It's easy. You don't got to work out every single day of the week. Only three times a week, so that's something I, I really like. But um, I'm going to let you guys enjoy the rest of the video. Thanks for stopping by, and I look forward to seeing you next time. Take care.